Hey everyone, how's it going? So today I'm going to be doing another unboxing for you. Again, I'm working with Crate Joy. I love them so much. If you guys aren't familiar, they are a marketplace for subscription boxes. They have tons on there. They're the largest, the one and only subscription box marketplace. I will link them down below for you guys if you would like to browse some of the different subscriptions that they have on their site. They're really, really cool. I love them. I have been using them for a really long time and I've done uh, multiple unboxings featuring products you can find on their site previously. So again, I will link them down below, but today this specific box we're going to be unboxing is by, let's see, Tamed Wild. And this is the, this side, the Wild Crystals box. I love crystals. I love crystal subscription boxes. I love the little surprise. Um, I like how they come usually with some sort of materials kind of teaching you about the products that are in the box and this one looked so so cool I'm really really excited I have been watching some unboxings of this previously in the past so I'm excited to share it with you guys uh, as we're moving along this unboxing I'll kind of go through everything of course that is in this guy and I will also link their specific box down below for you guys. As we're going through, if you guys have any questions or comments, please leave them for me down below. I would love to hear from you. And if you guys have checked out the site, I want to know what boxes you are interested in. If there's something you want me to unbox on my channel in future unboxings, let me know as well. Okay, so let's get into this guy. Again, this is by Tamed Wild. They have a few different boxes. Uh, the Wild Crystals one, they have like a Wild Medicine box, a Rituals box, things like that. Um, and I do want to try those in the future. But this one was the most interesting to me. It retails for $16.00 a month so this box has a new theme every single month and they send you let's see a carefully curated selection of natural crystals stones and minerals every month they also have information inside like I said as details on the theme and the crystals included and the very first box that you get is kind of like a welcome box they have some additional tools and things like that which you can learn more about if you do decide to do your own research and click on the link down below and look at their site um, that's a welcome box and that ships right away. The next boxes will ship out about midway through the month around the 15th it says. And there we go. That is what we've got going on. So this isn't going to be one of the monthly boxes. This is going to be the welcome box since it's my very first one. So let's get into the box. Hopefully I gave you all the information necessary. Um, and the background, let's dig in and see what we got. Okay, it looks like everything is wrapped up really nicely. Tons of bubble wrap which is good. All right, you guys, so here's a first glance of the box. You have some reading materials here, which I'll kind of try and pull out here. But <laughs> smooth. And here are the items inside. It looks like we have a nice big velvet pouch. I, it looks like I see a crystal grid and then some burlap pouches, with which I'm assuming have crystals in it. So let's get in to this box. I'm really excited. I want to see what's in the velvet pouch first. <laughs> Of course. Before we jump in and start unboxing things, I'm just going to read a tiny bit about the box that came in the welcome box in case you're curious. It just says welcome essentially. Their goal is to provide you with a monthly selection of healing crystals, stones and minerals and other related items. With this first box, we've included tools that will aid in harnessing the stone's energy, cleaning and charging and creating a crystal grid. Future shipments will build on these tools while growing your healing crystal collection. How cool is that? Um, Below, we'll find details on the gridding, smudging, and stuff like that. So that's all there for you guys. I don't need to really get into that here. But on the back, it says there's like a list of a bunch of different types of crystals with their properties listed on the back. And it says you've been given stones for your grid at random in this box. And with the hopes that the stones you need find you. They always say that about crystals. So go to the ones that you're drawn to. Uh, below is some information on possible stones in the box with their common uses. If your stone is not listed here, you can search for it on their website. Okay, so let's dig in to the stones. Okay, so this is a really cute velvet pouch. There's a cool gold design on the front. Um, and let's take the crystal out. Oh, 
Ooh. Okay, I'm gonna give you guys a close up. This is stunning. I'm looking through everything and it doesn't say what it is, but I'm almost certain that this is a smoky quartz. Uh, I have something like this that's a lot smaller. This one is really, really dark in color at the tips, which is really, really pretty. Um, and it has this cool kind of cluster shape. It's so, so pretty. Um, I really like quartz. I think they're like basic staple stones to have in your collection. And this one specifically is really pretty. Um, it would look really pretty sitting out. Uh, so yeah, I really like this. One thing I will say is that I, I wish there would have been something about this specific stone inside, like something written, um, and I'm not seeing anything for that uh, particularly, but nonetheless, maybe they don't because it's such kind of like a more basic piece. Um, so there's that. Smoky Quartz is a really good one for elevating moods and helping with things like depression, jealousy, anxiety, things like that. It can relieve stress and it can kind of help transform negative energies into positive ones so it's a really cool stone and I like the size of this one of course as I said before and it would be really cool to use in like a crystal grid um, so I'm excited to have this one but again I wish it had that information in the box okay next we have some tiger's eye crystals in this little burlap sack these are labeled and I will take them out here for you guys it says on that little card that I read for you guys that Tiger's Eye is a protection stone popular for use in travel. It grounds, centers, and increases willpower and mental strength. It's kind of funny that I have those. I will be traveling over Christmas, so um, these are really, really cool. I will look and see. I don't have any Tiger's Eye, actually. I do know what it looks like, but I don't have any in my collection. Oh, these are cool. These are some little polished stones. I'll give you guys a really quick close up here. Hopefully you guys can see these here. So there's just four crystals in that little bag. A really pretty kind of golden color. Alright, next I have a black obsidian crystal. I don't have... Oh, my phone! Okay, this is a protection stone. So let's see what we got here. It feels flat. Oh, and there we have it. This is a, I don't know if you can see it here. I'll give you guys a close up. So yeah, so this is a carved arrowhead shape, which is really cool. I'm gonna set it aside. This one actually came with a little reading material, which I think is awesome. So I'm gonna go over this since I am not super familiar with this one. It says, of course, it has healing properties for the physical body. A black obsidian is said to be a reliever of pain and aid those who have anxiety or phobias. It's known to ease frustrations towards others and keep the calm and keep calm in stressful situations. It's kind of funny there's a correlation with the stones I have currently, isn't there? Um, black obsidian is a powerful protection stone and is popular for those who need protection from psychic attacks. Okay, care and cleaning. It has, you know, ways to care for and clean this specific stone. It is kind of different for different types. It has a little bit of its history, um, how it's used in rituals, and some lore about it as well. So I really like these cards, and they're pretty. Like You could save them, and I will. So there's that stone. I'll set that aside. And next we have, okay, this one is not labeled. Um, I'll show you the bag here. Uh, no label on this one in particular. I don't know if it fell off or if it's just something that I will know when I see. Oh, you know what? It's not labeled, but I have a card for it here, and I would have known it. This is a little amethyst cluster. You see it here. I actually love amethyst. Um, it seems kind of basic, but it's popular for a reason. This one has awesome healing properties as well, and is really awesome for insomnia, which I'm going to need to put this one <laughs> by my bed. Uh, maybe I'll put like 75 of them by my bed because sleeping... For me is a luxury okay so on their card they says it helps calm the nervous uh, system and prevents nightmares <laughs> i had a nightmare about bears the other day it was not cool man metaphysically it's believed to bring luck and prosperity prevent marital infidelity okay <laughs> soothe the mind and soul it's a popular stone to use during meditation and grounding again it has care and cleaning some history and lore with this one so these are cute i really like these cards and i like that they're in the box um, i'm a fan of the way this one is laid out so far uh this is definitely a keeper i'm gonna continue to subscribe to this one i'm a fan okay now in the box is the last thing we've got our crystal grid this one i can already tell it looks really big 
yes, this is the biggest one I have for sure. Um, here is a peek at it. Am I showing it all on camera? I gotta lean back. This one has a really pretty kind of lotus flower design. Um, love this. Okay, I will definitely be putting this to use. I like how it's laid out. I don't know, I'm a fan of this one. Anyways, all right, so that is everything in the Wild Crystals Welcome box. Uh, I'm excited to try this one again. Uh, overall thoughts, I really, really like it. I like how it's laid out. It feels expensive. Um, it's really kind of chic feeling. I also really like the price point. I feel like this one in particular seems like a very, very affordable crystal box. Some of them are quite expensive because crystals are kind of expensive. They can be anyways, depending on the stone. Uh, so yeah, this one seems to be a really, really good value. So I'll definitely continue to unbox this one on my channel for you guys because I'm, I'm really, I'm, de I'm here for it. I like it. Again, I'll also leave a link to Crate Joy down below. And hey, you guys, Christmas is right around the corner and giving subscription boxes is a really cool gift idea as well. So if you need any last minute ideas, definitely check them out. Uh, if you guys are not a subscriber to my channel, I would love to have you hit that subscribe button for more videos, all sorts of different beauty and lifestyle videos for you guys. I love you so much. Give this video a thumbs up. If you like it, be sure to leave me a comment letting me know what you think about this box. And I I will see you guys in the next one. Bye. Mwah.